Today we are talking about how we find and select Timothy hay. High quality, nutritious Timothy hay is actually very hard to find. Let's get into it. Most of the companies you come across do things differently from how we select and package our hay. Number one, their selection process is different. And when we say different, it means not as intensive. Some of the companies are using their own farm to produce the hay they sell. While this sounds good, the problem is, is it's almost impossible to produce the same extremely high quality Timothy hay year after year. That's because you need near perfect weather conditions, harvest conditions, and field conditions every year. This is very difficult, if not impossible, to do year after year on the same farm. It's entirely mother nature. While they don't grow on their own farm, other companies, the larger ones, purchase in large quantities. They're just not searching or inspecting at a high enough standard to find the very best hay. They're basically quantity over quality. They're doing a pretty good job, but for small animals that are very picky, finding the best hay is very important. Even a tiny difference in quality can mean the world of a difference for a bun. In contrast, we have traveled all over the U.S. searching for farms that have yielded the best Timothy hay that year. We travel from Ellensburg, Washington, all the way down the West Coast and even further. We purchase hay in several different states and growing regions. Harvest season is one of our favorite times of year because we speak with dozens of farmers and inspect hundreds of fields searching for that one perfect crop your bun will go crazy for. This harvest season, our hay inspectors Billy and his younger brother Cody traveled over 22,500 miles. There you go, that's my brother Cody. I'm Billy. Networked with over 80 different farmers and looked at hay in five different states. And it has paid off. Billy and Cody, in the 10 years of seeking out premium hay, believe this to be the best they have ever seen. So we are beyond excited about it. That's what it looks like when it's just, just been cut literally five minutes ago. Also, we are thrilled to announce for Small Pet Select's 10 year anniversary, we are offering 10% off our 2022 Harvest Hay for a limited time only. Use this promo code at checkout to receive a discount. If your picky pet doesn't find it absolutely irresistible, email us within 14 days and we'll make it right. By the way, 10 random commenters on this video will receive a free hay sampler package. Check the description for more information and details on how to enter. Let's get into the second difference. Most of the other larger companies are machine packaging their hay on an assembly line. For example, they use machines to compress the hay into the packaging, which can shatter the hay and minimize the quality in the process. Also, it can introduce dust and other particles to the hay as well. While machine packaging has the cost advantages, this process doesn't allow them to go the extra mile and quality check what they're putting on the shelves. It's not bad hay necessarily, but for quality great hay, you have to put in the extra effort. We hand package all of the hay we harvest and personally ship it to our customers. There are no machines used in our packaging process. It takes extra time, effort, and work, but it's worth it. This allows us to keep an eye on quality throughout. The difference in selecting and packaging is why so many people tell us our hay appears fresher and better quality. Once again, thank you so much, guys. We are so proud to have you as part of our Small Pet Select community. If you like what you learned in this video and want to learn more, hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell.